how do we read this number? Do you still remember the place values that you learned when you were in grade 3? We separate the place values into groups of three, known as periods. The periods are ones, thousands, millions, billions, trillions, and so on. How many periods are there in this number? We have the ones period and the thousands period. So how do we read this number then? Remember, when reading, always read the numbers from left to right. First, read the digits or number in the thousands place, or I mean thousands period. Since the number is in the thousands period, add the word thousand when reading the digits or the number. Say 115,000. After that, Continue reading the number in the ones period. Since it is in the ones period, you don't need to add any words. Just read the number as it is. 831. So this number reads as 115,831. How about when you write this number in words? Keep this in mind. In writing numbers in words, the simple rule is as you read the number, so is when you write it in words. The only thing you need to add is to put a comma after each period. Again, this number is read as 115,831 So if you write this in words, it becomes 115,000 Put a comma and then write 831 Kids, hyphenate all numbers between 21 and 99 Less those ending 0, example, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, and 90. Let's have more examples. How do we read this number? This number has two periods, ones and thousands. Therefore, we read this as 23,400. 68. As you read the number, so is when you write it in words. But do not forget to put a comma after each period. This number is written as 23,468. Kids, don't put a period at the end unless it is part of a given problem how about this number can you read this number for me very good this number reads as 937,283 how about if you write this in words let me see if you write it correctly Wow, that's amazing. This number is written as 937,283. Now kids, please do this activity. Write the following numbers in words. Here are the answers. I hope you got the perfect score. 